Yo, what's going on, you guys? It's your boy Nenrik, and today I'll be doing a video discussing Kite's return. Now, when it comes to Kite, we know that he is a very special character in the Hunter x Hunter series for multiple reasons. Number one, he was Gon's teacher, and I know some people are going to be thinking, okay, wait, before you say he's Gon's teacher, let's back up. Don't you remember his other teachers like Wing and Bisky? Yes, that is true that Wing and Bisky, they both did teach Gon a lot more, and I believe that when it comes to, like actually training and like developing Gon's like ability, Nan ability, they did a lot more wing sun was one that really helped him like open up his nan like helped him actually figure out what type of nan user he was all that stuff wing sun was a great teacher biscuits trained them got them stronger ended up actually like helping them learn like their techniques and stuff so whiskey and wings or oh, well, i just combined their name biscuit and wing sun they were both valuable teachers when it comes to teaching on the net however the one thing that they did lack was the emotional connection and they really didn't have like a huge emotional connection with gone as much as kite did because kite he was there from the beginning we saw what happened when he basically saved gone's life from an early age so gone he was he kind of like you know he kind of felt some type of way towards kite even though some people they don't know that in the anime that actually did happen or in the in the original series like in the manga it showed that like earlier on it showed that i believe that, that was one of the first couple of chapters but in the anime that happened like around the chimera and arc so it made a lot of people think okay this must be like just pulling out of nowhere but no kite did have a special relationship with gone from the very beginning and then we know of kite and his tragic downfall yes we know his tragic downfall where he basically ended up giving up his own life because he was trying to save both gone and kill one now there's a lot of people saying stuff like oh kite he could have won if he never lost an arm even kill was like yo if we weren't there kite could have won and all this other thing but i'm gonna be honest i don't think that's true because nefropito she was shown to be super strong like even netro there was, there was even discussion if netro will be able to take her down granted netro he did get like two like good hits in on her slapped her around a bit but overall there was some discussion on whether she if she could actually defeat Netero. so that is actually crazy and me personally i don't think that kite was on that level and then once we saw kite die that was one of the most traumatic moments for gone because gone ended up going insane we know that gone basically was like you know what i gotta get revenge for kite we saw how i guess you say evil i don't i don't want to call him evil but just how like menacing he was he basically like was turning his back on everybody even people like Kilwa were scared for him so kite's death really did do a huge number on gone and yeah that basically changed him for a long time but then after Gon actually did get his revenge and actually did avenge him, we found out that Kite was basically, I guess you could say reincarnated. He was brought back to life because we saw that he was basically turned into this little girl. And this was actually interesting because Kite, now he actually did like retain some of his memories from the time of him actually being like the adult. Like we see him talking to Gon and saying stuff like, you don't have to apologize, all this other stuff. And Kite basically promises Gon that they're going to end up meeting again. So this is foreshadowing for them to have a great, great relationship in the future. Now, to get to the main point of this video, I just believe that we will see a Kite return. Yes, I believe that this Kite, he, she, she, I don't, I don't even know what to call it to be honest, but he or she will return back into the series and it will be an amazing moment simply because we're going to have Kite finally be able to use like all of his net ability because we didn't really get to see Crazy Slots used in action. Like I believe we were missing out on a couple more numbers. So I think that it would be dope if we did get to see all the numbers or what if kite comes back with you like and a whole new ability i think it would be dope to see kite and gone actually fighting together i think it would be amazing in the upcoming arc so yeah overall do you guys want kite to return in the series me personally i've been waiting for a long time for this because kite yeah he was uh he was a great character i enjoyed kite a lot so when he comes back it is going to be hype comment what you guys see down below subscribe if you haven't peace out